Albert Einstein called compounding effect, eighth wonder of the world. Let's see this example. This is Sonu and this is his friend Monu. Both get a job. Sonu's friend Monu gets a monthly salary offer of $1 million, for which his family and friends congratulate him. But Sonu is given a strange offer, that he will get only one cent, which will double daily for next 31 days. And Sonu accepts this offer. On one hand, $1 million for a month. And on the other hand, Sonu's one cent offer, which will get doubled daily for a month. Pause the video and tell me in five seconds who took the better decision. Common Sense says that Sonu's friend Monu took the better decision. But after 31 days, the result shocked everyone. Let's see what happened. Before that, let me tell you something, which you won't believe. Once a very intelligent but poor man goes to a king, the king is so happy with his intelligence that he says, I am ready to give you anything you want. Gold, silver, diamonds, jewels. He says, I don't want any of these. He sees a chessboard and says, I want a grain of wheat and put it on the first box of the board, and then double that grain on every box. So on the first food, one grain. On the second, two, three, four, on the fourth, eight. And so on, after doubling on every box. Give me the number of grains which will be on the last box of the board. The king is shocked and laughs. What did you ask for? The king asks him to think again, and says, I want this. He orders his ministers to start counting grains. You must be wondering how many grains will be there. One two, three, four, eight, 16, 32, and so on, two lines, on 16 boxes. The total grains were around 65,000, which is not much to hear, but then the real story begins. After 32 boxes, the total number of grains was 4.29 billion, which is around 280 metric tons. And reaching the 64th box, which was the last box, the number of grains becomes this much, which is hard to say. Put 18 zeros behind 18, which makes 1.5 trillion metric tons. This is a huge number. In 2020, the world's total wheat production was 765 million metric tons. And this number is 2,000 times more. If this much wheat is kept in a big city like Delhi, it will be as tall as Mount Everest, which is enough for the world, for the coming 1,000 years. So he was so intelligent that he was asking for the entire world's wealth because he knew the power of compounding, which is called eighth wonder, which is very small in the beginning. But as it grows, it becomes exponential. You may ask, what is the use of all this? If we know this, it is no less than magic. After understanding this, let's see what happened to Sonu's one cent salary. When he gets one cent on the first day, it becomes two cents on the second day, four cents on the third day, and eight cents on the fourth day. And on the 10th day, it becomes $5.12. On the 15th day, it becomes $163.84. And on the 20th day, it becomes $5,242.88. You won't see a difference for 20 days. In comparison to 1 million, it is only 5,000. It has been more than half a month. But the real story begins. 21st day, 10,485 rupees. 25th day, 1, 67,772. 28th day, 13, 42,177. 33rd day, 53, 68,712. And on the 31st day, 1, 0, 7, 37,418 dollars, which is 9.7 million more than Manu's 1 million salary. This is the power of compounding. If you find these two examples surprising, then let me tell you something. These two examples are nothing compared to this. If we take a paper with the width of one thousandth of one centimeter, how many times can you fold this paper? Experiments show that we can't fold more than seven times. But hypothetically, if we fold a paper 45 times, what do you think the height of the paper will be? Pause the video for five seconds and guess. Maybe 10 meters, maybe 100 meters. Let's see. When we fold the paper for the first time, it becomes 0.002 centimeters. After the second fold, it becomes 0.004 centimeters. Similarly, after the third and fourth, when we fold the paper for the tenth time, it becomes one centimeter. After 17 folds, it becomes four feet. But the real story begins. It becomes 1,100 feet, which is equal to an 80-story building. And from here, the growth becomes exponential. If we fold it two more times, it will be taller than Burj Khalifa. After 30 folds, 
It will be 34,320 feet, which is the average height of a flying airplane. After 40 folds, it is as far as our GPS satellite. Orbit the Earth. If we fold it 45 times, it will be so tall that we can reach the moon, which is 400,000 kilometers. And if we fold it again, we can reach the moon and come back. We can use this concept in health, knowledge, and money. For example, if we want to keep our body healthy, we need to take small steps for it. If we are eating fried food, sugar, junk food, and not exercising, it may not affect us. But when health starts deteriorating, we'll start with exponential growth. It is not because we did something wrong recently, but for the last 20, 30, 40 years, we have been doing harm, but the result was not visible. Similarly, if we start making small efforts for investment, knowledge, or work, we may not see the result for a long time. But if we are patient and continue the work, there will come a time when exponential growth will happen and we may not be able to believe that it is possible and this is called the power of compounding. If you found this concept interesting, do share it with your friends. Thank you for watching.